Welcome to Proofpoint's how-to video tutorial series, which is aimed at sharing Proofpoint's professional services, best practices for configuring the Proofpoint Protection Server's features and functionalities. This video tutorial demonstrates how to view terms caught by a dictionary rule within the Proofpoint Protection Server, or PPS. A dictionary is a text file containing a list of terms. Dictionaries can be used to detect if any emails passing through the Proofpoint system contain certain words or phrases. To view or add dictionaries, select the Email Protection tab and then expand the Email Firewall module. Click on the Dictionary page and then select the Enabled checkbox allowing the system to scan email content for any dictionary word matches. To view the words in the dictionary, simply click on the dictionary name. By default, a rule created to match and identify dictionary words within an email will not show the words that were identified. Dictionary rules can be modified to create message headers which will contain the triggered dictionary terms. To display the terms, you can add them to a header in the email for later inspection. To edit a dictionary rule, navigate to the Email Firewall module and Rules page and select the dictionary rule you wish to edit. For this example, the rule is attempting to detect sensitive words within an email and block them. Select the Change Message Headers checkbox and then click the Add button. Choose an appropriate name and value for the header. Remember to save your changes in the Change Header dialog box and on the Rules page. To view the dictionary terms caught by the rule, navigate to the System tab, Quarantine Module, Folders page. Select the folder name where the triggered emails are stored. In this example, there's a message which was detected because it contains sensitive words. Open the message and then select the View drop-down menu and choose the term Headers. The header X identified terms will contain each word that was found within the dictionary. The number in front of each term specifies the amount of times a sensitive dictionary word was found within the email. In our example, the terms confidential, secret, and internal were encountered once, while the term COBRA project was detected three times. If the email was not blocked and delivered or released, you can view the header on the email client of the recipient, like Microsoft Outlook. You can also use this variable elsewhere in the rule, for example, within the Send a Message To field, the Reply To field, or even the Subject field. Thank you for watching our brief how to video tutorial on how to view terms caught by a dictionary rule within the Proofpoint Protection Server, or PPS. For additional information on our products, visit our knowledge base at https colon forward slash forward slash proofpointcommunities.force.com. For questions, comments, or feedback on this tutorial, please email us at training at proofpoint.com.